Today for Mousetrap Monday, we are gonna test out a brand new mousetrap I recently found on eBay. It looked kind of like a rolling log mousetrap, only different, and it comes out of Shenzhen, China. And the description's pretty interesting. It says, designed according to the exercise habits of mice. So easy for the rat to lose its center of gravity and roll in the barrel. It's up to you to grab the mouse and kill it or release it. It humanizes the trap. Well, the photos in the ad make it look like a pretty large trap, but it comes in a small package. So let's remove it from the box and see what it looks like. The trap's made out of gray plastic and it looks like it folds here. Ooh, spring-loaded. The mice will climb up the ramp, come out to get the bait. There's a little bait cup right here. You put peanut butter there and it'll roll on these series of rings. Now I'm not sure if this is gonna work. It looks like the whole trap rolls like a rolling log and the extra rings. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. Now I'm curious if it actually works. But first, we're gonna test it out with our pet mice. So let's go set it up on the bucket and see if they'll get caught in these Chinese rolling mouse trap. We have our bucket here. Really, this trap couldn't be more easy to set up. It unfolds. There's some tabs there that fit on the lip of the bucket. You just put bait on the end. We'll cover the tip with peanut butter. That's gonna spin, so I'll put some on the bottom. You can also lock in the joint right here so it's more of an angle. It's all ready to go. We're gonna get our pet mice, but first I'm gonna add a soft landing with some fabric. Now my pet mice have done this quite a bit and they might be more cautious than wild mice, but we'll give them a chance and see what happens. We'll start with Goldie. Oh, that worked well. It spun on the rings. Let's get another mouse. Here you go. Oop, that was quick. Now I don't know if this is gonna work with wild mice, if they have more balance or not. Our pet mice are pretty cautious and they don't like going on things that move, but we did catch them. The only way to know if it actually works is to go set it up in the barn with motion cameras and see if we can catch wild mice. Well, down in the bottom of our bucket, we have a mouse. It wanted the bait, stepped on a Chinese plastic roller mouse trap, and dropped down. So it does work. What we caught is a native deer mouse. So I'm gonna let it go. Let's take it out in the wild and set it free. Okay, mouse, come on out of there. Well, that was quick. On my YouTube channel, I test out every different kind of mouse trap I can get my hands on. Some of them are amazing and work well. Others are pretty terrible and don't catch mice. And in between, we have mouse traps that are okay. I placed this mouse trap in that category. It does work, but mice also avoided it. It's an interesting design with the rings, the rolling, and the walk the plank. Three great mouse traps all combined in one, but it's not perfect. If I was gonna set it up again, I think I'd completely douse the rings in peanut oil. But it's still a cool looking design and I'm gonna place it in the mouse trap collection as a very unique mouse trap from China. Thank you so much for watching my videos and thanks to all the viewers who are sending me art. I love seeing the pictures. If you haven't subscribed, please consider clicking that button. I've posted over 600 videos on YouTube and currently I'm posting new videos every Monday and Friday. 
So if you want to see the best videos on how to catch mice, rats, squirrels, chipmunks, moles, voles, and gophers, stay tuned.